This is Twit. One of my thrills of Davos was getting to sit across from Tony Fidel of uh, Nest Oh, was he last there? Night. Oh, yeah. What did he say? Yeah, he's here. Oh, he's just a really charming, charming, nice guy. Uh, I asked him about whether he was in the Google Hotel, and he said, "Oh no, it's not closed yet. We can't, you know, we can't do any of that stuff." Yeah. But really fascinating to hear him talk about about Nest and about the the, the protect thing and uh, and how they're, they're going to spread bit by bit, and why it made sense to be bought by by Google. That that um, you know, was, oh, can was you the share right time. that? Um, yeah, I, I don't. I don't think anything was 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 secretive about it. I think I think that that you know you you go for more money, uh, and then you've got to uh, you know meet this really high barrier. And um, he 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 talked in, in Munich about how he talked to a lot of companies over time. It just took a long time. But when he sat down with Larry Page, it was just obviously kismet. He said, I go into meetings and I think I'm going to teach somebody something to get somewhere in this meeting. You know how you spell kismet? $3.2 billion. Amen. <laughs> well, he, he worked the hell out of it. Kismet! But he also said he learned a lot out of, out of Larry. And, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. $3.2 well, you know, no, no. billion. Dollars. <laughs> yeah, but it, what he told the employees is, you know, and it's a line you hear all the time in these purchases. What they really did was invest in Nest. Yes, but it's yes. it's true. They have the resources. Uh, they're going to be able to do amazing things. I, I went up to him afterwards because he talked about and this. Is one of the stories in the rundown. He has said, you know, we're not going to change our privacy policy when we do. If we do, we'll let you know. Blah blah blah. And I said, listen, yeah. I want Wave to tell Nest on my way home. Oh, he's in traffic. Wait an hour before you put the heat up. I want those connections. And he yeah, said, yeah, gonna, yeah, yeah I think it, most people do. But, we're but, not going to ever, ever change our privacy policies, which is a stupid thing to say and, and put them say right that. in line with. Right. Well, no, they said we weren't going to change. We're not going to share data. We're not going to. I mean, I recall it as being pretty clear. The first day was we aren't changing anything. We're not sharing our data, which is a stupid thing to say because you are not the CEO, founder, whatever right. of your company forever. Right. And Google has made similar promises how they will never do anything and they do 180 degree turns. Then the next day is, well, if we make some changes, you know, we'd give you lots of notice. So, yeah, <laughs> they're going to make changes. They're going to make changes that will upset some people. They probably will share stuff with it. There'll be some benefits to doing it. But I just, it always makes you laugh when you have a founder act like they've sold their company, but the company is never going to change. Yeah. Because it changes. You don't because have any choice. It's a company and it's no longer your company. It's called, it's no I gave yours. you $3.2 billion. Yeah. Now shut up and go away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's okay. I would take the money and run.